Now, let's try to look at what we have on our uh, database. Now, view users. Okay, line 77, there is an error there. Line 77. Sorry, I need to remove this. Okay, it should work now. Definitely, it should work. Good, okay, line 59. 59, okay. Okay, sorry, my SQL leak. Sorry. Okay, let's check. Now you can see it works. Now, okay. Good. Now, what we have here right now, it's uh, properly set. So let's uh, now, but you can see once we over through this, it uh, looks funny. So let's go straight to the file again and uh, undo some things here. Now, let's go to the style. This should. Uh, this should be from the style okay let's change this to uh, black okay let's change this to black and uh, let's go back and check boom now you can see we are it's very good now i think uh, from what we have here we are okay but i think there is no difference between this and um you know let's do some other thing here um Okay, the table head. Um, okay. Okay, let's add a class here. Oh, table. Sorry. Table. 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 Uh, let's say over. Okay, let's check now. Boom. Now you can see there's a difference between the, uh, you know, the head and the body now. So this looks wow but the next thing we haven't done here it's the uh, delete the php so once you click this it doesn't work the file will not be found so what we need to do is to go to our um text editor and create delete the php so but you can see this is from database now if you uh, if you insert some more in your database now this will be tracked through this place now let's go straight to our this let's go straight here and let's open the new or uh, something now let's save let's save it now as delete delete dot uh, sorry delete dot uh, php now the first thing you need to do is to uh, you know start your php tag and close it now what you need to do is uh, include include okay now include um our connection folder connection.php sorry 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 include the dish and uh, need to put this now what is the name of the file uh, connection dot php now um, okay there's a, there's a variable here delete let's go id okay get okay semicolon at the back so this is delete okay now another variable delete ID okay no 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 okay delete uh, query now this is this go to features uh, we are going to use this to write an SQL uh, statement now after this a go to run so so as not so as first not to forget the variables we are going to use so um, delete query now delete from where now you need to choose users sorry users i mean the table 
No. Where? Where user ID equals sorry. Okay, I need this. Yeah. User ID equals uh, delete. Let's go ID. Okay. Yeah. Now no, run. Uh, before that, um, okay, okay. Let's let's go on. Now I need to run um, something. Okay. Okay. Am I correct? Yes, I should be. Now before this, okay, okay, okay. My SQL. Let's go um, query. My SQL query equals um, okay. Um, DB con that means from a database connection folder, comma delete delete that's called query. Okay, now if that means we're trying to run this, that means if this exists, sorry, do the following. Good now, if this exists. If um, run this, if this uh, sorry, if run is successful, then do echo. Okay, echo script. Okay, um, okay, 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 okay. We need to use uh, this and uh, terminate it with semicolon. Now open the uh, script. Scripts. window open now in it we need to put uh, okay comma this again okay now this is a uh, that means take us back to that um sorry take us back to uh, where we are coming from view users PHP and it should open on itself okay okay but before we go to these okay now after this it should tell us that uh, okay deleted sorry deleted deleted equals uh, user has been uh, deleted okay now let's see if this will work first uh, from user okay from users okay that's our file okay let's go to this place and copy our connection file here copy so as to avoid errors uh wish it here okay now this should work now let's go straight to what we have uh, and check it out if it's work finally now now let's delete this now let's check our database first before we move on so as to be sure now we have our users here now we have two users remaining here we have g we have now we want to delete this g instead of me clicking on this just use this um, now click on delete now okay 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 there is an error here okay sorry it has been deleted but it didn't return us back to uh, where we are coming from view or it's called users the php deleted because user has been deleted okay okay let's try to um, insert some um, some more here okay 
so let's uh, insert okay let's say um, Liger username dot fog let's say uh, fog at uh, gmail.com password for okay now let's enter more let's say Joshua sorry Joshua username Josh now Josh at uh, gmail.com okay then password let's say gmail now let's say go now we have some more uh, okay this is successful okay we have four more here now let's refresh this um, and see okay now let's try to delete this now i think the major web problem is is just that the capital u i put the capital w i put here i think is the major problem so let's change it back to small w and um v okay delete good it works now that means just this just just this simple w makes it not to work so you can uh, try it again delete now it returns back us to where we are thank you i'll meet you in the next video where we take the view orders the view complaints and the logouts and we also create a login where admin can have access to this thank you see you in the next video goodbye